This video is sponsored by X-Ray Servers. They provide amazing high quality servers for very, very affordable prices, starting at 50 cents for a slot. They cover a wide variety of games such as TF2, CSGO, ARK, and a bunch of others. You can also now pay for your servers with items as well. If you would like to do that, all you have to do is add the owner of the Steam group and contact him from there. Both of the links you will need are gonna be in the description below. Hey guys, really quickly before this video starts, I just wanna let you guys know that I might be, in the next couple of days, going into my Discord voice channel and talking to you guys about some ideas that you might have for the channel and basically just some stuff that you'd like to improve and things you think I should be doing. So, if you wanna be part of that, I don't know really when it's gonna be, more information will come out when it's ready, but if you wanna be part of that, make sure you join my Discord server, the link will be in the description, and yeah, it's gonna be a good time. You'll, we'll just have a casual chat as well, it won't just all be about ideas, but it's gonna be really helpful for me and you guys should be quite entertained as well. And it's a good way to get your ideas onto this channel. So yeah. Hey guys, and welcome to a new video. Today, I'm just gonna be talking to you guys about the Golden Pan trading series and basically where we're going with it. Cause right now, I don't feel like I'm updating you guys enough. I'm not really recording anything I'm doing. In fact, I'm not really doing anything for this trading series that much because I'm just too busy to trade right now. But basically what happened is we did actually sell the Steaming Torrents Helm, I believe, for the full Backpack.tf price of about 14 keys, I believe. And I also sold my alt account for 100 keys pure and a circling peace sign rotation sensation, which is about 50 keys. Now my alt account was worth 200 keys or about that at the time and I sold it, I was quick selling it, I guess, to people buying backpacks, so I was wanting about 140 keys about that, but I think 100 keys pure, plus a 50 key unusual, which, I, which is actually quite nice, isn't too bad of a deal. And the thing you can see on the screen right now is like my failed attempt of this video before, and basically what I've been doing now is the th last three pages, 38 and 39 and 40 are completely empty. Sent all of that away and given some of it away as well. And I'm using that to empty out my scrap.tf inventory I've gotten from donations and stuff like that. And basically just building that up for since I've started streaming pretty much. And I'm putting all of that onto my alt account and seeing just kind of how much it's worth. And then if I could sell that backpack again, we can get very, very close. So what I did also is I saw my disco beat down the old Baker Boy, and I sold that for an Australian Scatagon which has specialized kill streak, which is about 23 to 25 keys, I'd say. Like, regular one is 23. There you can see on the screen right now, that's the second piece of rotation sensation. Um, but yeah, the regular Australian Scatagon is, is 23. So I'd say with specialized kill streak, it could be around 25 or something like that. But I also got a strange Kappa, which is seven keys pure as well. So that is a good, like 30-ish keys for this unusual that's worth 27 now. As you can see, I'm like looking at the prices of all of my unusuals and stuff like that. And that is counting the rotation sensation, I believe. Uh, it, no, not right now, it's not. But basically a lot has changed since what you're looking at on the screen right now. Like I said, the last three pages are empty. Using that to take out, take out 150 items from scrap.tf, sending 150 items to, um, I don't know, to the alt account and just doing that over and over again. It's a long process and it's kind of boring, but we're making really good progress on it. And it would also help me clear out my scrap.tf inventory for more things for like donations and stuff like that. And then after I get this golden pan, all of my donations and stuff that I do end up like getting rid of, well not getting rid of, but like selling and stuff, that'll go straight back into giving you guys more things back. So once I get this golden pan, I don't really think I'll need anything else. Like, I don't feel like I want anything else right now. Maybe if I just keep getting donated keys and stuff like that, I'll go for a couple of nice unusuals for each class. I don't really know. All I really want after this golden pan is maybe get my Scorching Glengarry Bonnet back that I had for Demo Man before. Maybe get a Scorching Flames Soldier Unusual. And maybe get like a Burning or a Sunbeams Pyro Unusual. That's really all I want. Like my scout set is completely fine the way it is. Don't really want a specific unusual for that. And I don't really play the other classes enough to warrant me spending more time trading, which is not something I enjoy as much anymore. Uh, it doesn't warrant the time spent doing that to get an unusual that I probably won't ever really use. And my sets for most of those classes are actually okay. Like, I'm really happy with all of them. As you can see right here, I'm just scrolling down my inventory. There's the other Scatagon there. 
You saw that really quick. This is when I just did the trade, so all my inventory is a bit everywhere. But basically, we're making decent progress. We are about 600 keys away. No, we, are, we have 600 keys right now. I shouted, no, I'm sorry. We have about 600 keys right now. Should be getting another 140-ish from this alt account if I sell it again. And then we've just got a bunch of other stuff to do. Well, it's not like 160 keys or 600 keys pure. A lot of that is an unusual, so hopefully I'll be trying to sell them quite soon and we'll see what happens from there. And really the only trading I'm going to be doing after the Golden Pan, like I said, is getting those extra unusuals and also finishing some of the collections I have because I don't actually have that many collections that aren't... Um, that aren't finished. So as you can see here, I just finished my Mayflower collection because Pillsman actually donated that dead head to me, which is amazing. Finished off that collection and I've replaced it for the No Mercy in that set just to see what it looks like for a little bit and to make sure I'm using it. And there aren't that many other collections I need. I need about like three or four items, which isn't going to be that difficult to do. We also got a Space Hamster Hammy also donated by Pillsman to finish off the Confidential collection case. And basically we're making some really good progress with everything and I'm getting to the point now where it's I'm feeling like I'm wrapping up my trading overall and hopefully can be finishing this soon. So I don't know if there's going to be another trading series after the Road to Golden Pan, mainly because I don't really want anything else. I don't really want to dedicate myself to a trading series when I don't trade that much and my life is about to get so busy that I won't actually be able to trade. So that is a problem about trading now like I'll still make trading content don't worry about that I've still got a massive video project coming up about every scam method in the game and basically just a whole detailed thing about it and hopefully that'll start coming out soon I need to make I want to make like a bunch of them in, in advance before I actually start releasing them because I want it to be like a frequent thing and basically yeah that's going to do it for this video guys I hope you enjoy it we are getting very close to this pan I said in this take of the video I believe I wanted to get the pan by next June and or something like that like next summer time basically and I think we're going to be getting it by the end of this year I genuinely think we can get it by the end of this year so if we keep going for that hopefully we can hit it thanks you so much for watching leave a like if you enjoyed and I'll see you all tomorrow with another video goodbye